Sometimes you just want peace and quiet. This is a truck stop. At Bombay. And it's all closed, of course. And, uh, but yeah, it's nice and quiet. Beach is filling up. No trucks further than this. And now we're near somewhere. And the little corner here. Yeah. <laughs> It's 10 o'clock, um, I think it's time to go to bed. Good night. Hello, a very good morning. It's about 6 o'clock, that's my normal wake up time. And I'm at Bombay. Truck stop. Um, I'm going to find some breakfast because I'm not going to put up my kitchen gear in the middle of the truck stop. So, ooh, 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 ooh. let's have a look. Morning. Uh, can I have uh, uh, flat whites? Um, meat, um, oh, large, but white, uh, no, with sure. two sugars. Sorry about that. Um, yeah. Yeah, uh, that's, that's, that's it for now. Yes. Just one flat white, large, two sugar? Yes, please. Do you fly by, please? Uh, no, no. Sorry about that. Uh, Thank you so much. So I got my coffee. Good start of the day. A big rat out here. <laughs> and um, I just woke up uh, basically with um, some oil races very quietly They're like they were very quiet they're on their way somewhere but got some magic cars there some really nice ones look at that awesome very nice nice <laughs> yeah, I'm usually not a fan of um, those type of cars. I wouldn't buy um, any of them, except for the Merc, <laughs> if I had the money. Um, but that was nice. They're like, yeah, that was that was nice. They weren't uh, they were noisy. They were just you know, like they're just the lovers of cars. <laughs> And they were just all gathering together, and later on there were some more actually just coming in when I walked, um, rode out of the place. And um, you know, like I, I do, I do respect that. Um, you know, uh, those clubs. You know, like they um, they might go to Hampton Down, uh, which is not so far away from here, to um, you know what you call it uh, to. Uh, to the race course and uh, do a little bit of racing whatever you know like so um, yeah they have a gathering so yeah it's nice and they were nice nice kids nice kids you know they were all saying that the uh, the Merc was uh, old people's car <laughs> and, uh, I think that was the dad who uh, who uh, he, he, like was one one of them uh, was a parent and he uh, said, so, well, I like the old people car. <laughs> yeah, and it was nice to wake up next to, so put it that way, you know.
So yeah, that's um, Pocono Shops. It's only small, but oh my God, it gets busy here during the day because they have the, um, you know, the best ice cream, the best sausage. The, 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 the butcher over there is, um, is uh, basically world famous on this side of the planet anyway, for such good and absolutely affordable meat as well. So yeah, it's only a small place. What I like about uh, Pocono is as well that they have this camper place over here. And um, although they changed ownership and um, they used to have really nice cheap campers, but now they sort of upgraded and they got uh, more expensive ones. But still, you know, like there's, um, look at this, some beautiful, beautiful specimens over there. And uh, they're still second hand, but um, more like, see they've got a few old ones as well. The Isuzu over there that you see, Ford um, Transit, they still got some nice ones there. But they, um, they're going into more like caravans, which I don't really, um, I'm not a customer for, so I'll put it that way. That would be a nice one over there, that little one over there, yeah. That'd be nice, that'd be just perfect for me. But hey, um, and there you go, there's the sign of the um, Pocono Bacon. Goodbye, thanks for shopping at Pocono Bacon, happy and safe driving. They're, they're actually, they're, they're, they're world famous, to be honest, for their, um, for their meat, for their bacon and stuff. He's such a beautiful dog, this one. Hello. Hello, Misha. It's Misha as well. Hello, Misha. Hello. 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 I'll go in in a minute, but these ones are my two babies. They're my two little... Hey! They're my grandchildren. Hey, Iggy! Iggy and Misha. Beautiful doggies. Hello, Pukekoe Market! With my youngest. Yay! <laughs> Well, it was lovely to spend some time with um, a little Alexia, who's my little one. She's turning 16 soon. You haven't really seen her on uh, YouTube because she used to object to it. But she's getting a bit... Um, yeah, getting a bit easier to, to deal with, with like filming her. Uh, so I uh, just went shopping and uh, uh, for a few things and uh, bought some little things for her and all that stuff but um, yeah so that's my little one I got three of them um, I don't see her a lot she used to be with me for uh, about 10 years and then she sort of like when she was about 15 years old we decided to um, she needs a woman around her because her mother is nowhere to be found to be honest so she's living with Nicole, which is my 25 year old in Pocono and it goes really well. So every once in a while I visit her. But uh, yeah, just ended up at the markets and stuff like that. I'm on my way to Port Waikato. It started to rain, by the way, which is um, not heavy, but because we're going to have a party, which is mainly outside. I do believe they have a marquee and stuff like that. So, and I found a way to get into the camping ground as well via friends. So we're all sorted for tonight. So we're just um, on our way to Port Waikato. I'll do some filming when I get there. I'll see you there.